Hey, so today we're gonna go uninstall an ATM at this location. There's a tattoo parlor. I wasn't doing that many uh, transactions this month so far. They had done five transactions and we're uh, 28 days into the month of March. So I'd placed this ATM back in October. So the rest of the month of October, November, December, January, and then the 28 days of March. Just wanted to clarify that. It's been in there for more than 28 days. And so, yeah. And so that ain't cutting it for me. Uh, it is making some money, but not enough, not even close to enough. What I go for is 100 plus transactions every month in a location and this location was not doing it. So let's go and install it. Let's go. All right, so here's the first tool I'm gonna use to uninstall this ATM, this impact wrench. Just taking off the bolts. This one was able to come out, but some of these, I'll just try to hammer it down. I'm hammering down these anchors to make them flush with the floor. There is one anchor slash bolt that is sticking out the ground. So I'm gonna take an angle grinder and try to cut it off and make it as flush with the floor as I can. So I take this uh, I take this receipt paper out anytime I am transporting the ATMs, and all you gotta do is just pull it out. You know, uh, the receipt paper will just pull out, and uh, also take this little piece in the middle and don't lose it. All right, this little plastic holds the uh, receipt paper within the ATM, and store the antennas inside the ATM. We got the ATM loaded onto the bed of my truck. Now we're just strapping it down. And so, making sure it won't go nowhere, won't fly off the truck. It could potentially fly up out because uh, it's not strapped down to the bed. I got a towel underneath, avoid the ATM from getting scratched. I already got another location lined up for it, uh, hopefully. Um, it's looking like I'll be selling this ATM to a store owner and they're gonna be their own cash loader and I'm gonna be their processor. And so I'm gonna install this ATM for them sell it to them and then they'll be their own cash loader so let's see if that deal goes through that deal did not end up going through the atm guy i was dealing with stopped responding to me he was working as like the middleman connecting me to the store owner blah 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 whatever but what i ended up doing was selling this atm to my atm mentor he bought it off of me. I had uploaded the ATM onto Facebook group uh, asking for a said price. And he was willing to pay said price if I drove it up to him directly and sold it to him. And I did just that. I sold it to his team. And it was pretty cool checking out his operations he's got over there. I do my best to find great locations to place these ATMs. But not every single location is going to be a banger dynamite jackpot some locations are just not going to do well even though i'm very optimistic that this atm was going to do well it sometimes just doesn't but oh well it is what it is hey if you enjoy what you saw you think you got some value or entertainment out of this video be sure to drop a like for the youtube algorithm and if you're not already subscribed be sure to subscribe to my youtube channel new burns it you better do it right now